In more local news, a Rock County Fire Department is working with area firefighters this weekend, hoping to prepare them for the next big crash that they have to respond to. Our Anna Hansen shows us what their training looks like. Sometimes the biggest danger in a risky situation is a lack of preparation. It really matters when you get into those really complicated extrications. That's why the Edgerton Fire Department trains two times a month, dealing with any and all scenarios. And today's focus was on heavy extrications, accidents involving semi-trucks and other large vehicles. You don't do it all that often which actually plays into the fact that then you need to train on it more. The fire department has a protocol in dealing with bigger crashes, prioritizing what to do and where to start. Chief Randall Pickering says that it begins before the firefighters even reach the scene. The first thing you do is you take a look at what are we going to get ourselves into? What are the safety risks? If we can confirm that we're in a safe situation, then we're going to come forward. After they make sure it's safe, the firefighters do two things, stabilize the vehicles and secure the passengers. You're really doing two things. You're looking at the number of patients potentially involved and what is it going to take to stabilize the vehicles. The department was joined today by instructors from Auto X, an Illinois-based extrication company. They say that while the heavy-duty crashes like the ones they're training on today aren't frequent, they're certainly high risk. Do you always want to have a plan, plan A, plan B, and even sometimes a plan C? Which is why they take the time to travel across the country, educating first responders on the right techniques and tools to deal with them. Sharing the knowledge that, that you can't keep knowledge, you have to share it. In preparing through training sessions like these, the firefighters become better equipped to respond to interstate emergencies. That was our Anna Hansen reporting. The fire department will continue its training tomorrow, bringing in a wrecker from Dewey's Towing and Auto Repair in Beloit. They say it's necessary to help prepare for bigger accidents.